exercise yeah that, that's just something i just came from it's good for you yeah so i highly recommend you exercise yourself all right i'm josh vicasio you gorgeous human being you how are you doing and in this hashtag project nine minute video where i make videos that last nine minutes long exactly for the sake of upskilling and honing this present skill that i thought of 10 days ago we are now on day 10 of this 30 day challenge and yesterday i was out of the loop i did not really uh explain properly or what i intended to properly explain uh, about responsibility but then i did say that we're going to talk about exercise tomorrow and tomorrow is now today and that's what we're going to be talking about so exercise yes that is something i highly recommend everyone do not on a daily basis unless you really have the, a fitness goal or it's part of your job to look good to feel good to be strong um and all the other benefits but aside from that aside from all the other good things about working out is it, it gives you a sense of accomplishment at the end of the day you know the process of actually working out you know like this you know, i just came from a 26 minute chloe ting workout and it was a hit high intensity interval training because you know you save time because you know i did make a video on time uh, so you save more time while gaining the same benefits as say with a two hour one hour jog but it just compounded in 30 minutes, but it's high intensity interval training. There's other benefits to that. I might make a video of that in the future if you guys are interested or if I feel like I can actually bring out the value out of that. But for now, we're, we're just going to generalize it in exercise. And yeah, like I said, it makes you feel good at the end of the day during the workout, for, especially for, you know, if you're someone that doesn't enjoy, you know, physical strenuous activity. Yeah, the process may be fun for those, but may also be excruci excruciating for others. But you know, you just have to go, go with the process. Just think, you know, for the next five minutes, just do this. It's good when you actually have a coach or you're watching a YouTube video. You can just follow along. All right, you don't have to think about your own pro workout program because there's already lots of programs out there with you know backed up results and then you know the programs have already a solid foundation and you can just follow those you know don't don't change the wheel all right just you know just follow what works unless you're a professional then you can make your own plan but then aside from that it's it's really easy because you know just watching a youtube video follow what they do it doesn't have to be exactly the same but you know just keep in mind that the form keeping the form is actually really important all right by not the same, like you don't have to follow them step by step. If you're tired, rest, take a break, hit the pause button, all right? Drink a sip of water, you know, take a five minute break, then get back to it. You know, as you progress along your workout journey, then you'll eventually be able to, you know, fully perform the whole workout without rest. And then, you know, it's like, it's a, it's a long term kind of improvement because you know on day one all right especially if you're someone that hasn't worked out in a while you know or you're just still starting your fitness journey or it's been a while and then you know you 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 know went into your bad habits and then just over ate you know just too many french fries some ice cream too much coke then <laughs> yeah then it's going to probably not be as easy as you think it would. But then over time, as you progress, as you work out, as you, you know, show up every single day, you know, as you work out and then you follow this routine on a week, then the next month, and then, you know, maybe after two months, you'll, you'll feel better, you'll feel strong, you'll feel good, you know, you'll have things that you can actually do that you couldn't have done before otherwise. So yeah, working out is really, really cool. So yeah, I highly recommend that you work out uh, as a starter advice because, you know, I have been doing some doing fitness for a while. I can do seven pull-ups consecutively now. I'll probably flex on that in the future. But before I could only do three, actually one. Well, it starts off with one. Actually, before, before, you could hardly even do one. You could just hang. And then, you know, at least it's something. At least you're hanging because, you know, there's specific muscles in your body that actually gets triggered when you're hanging, which it will be necessary to actually do a full proper pull-up. It's called a progression. And then, you know, after you can actually do a pull-up, then you aim for two, then you aim for three. It's, you know, progressive overload. Over time, you'll get better. You train your body. You train your muscles. And then, you know, there's also this thing about muscle memory. Like 
something about T4 cells. I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. Um, but <laughs> yeah, as, as you, you know, consistently perform a workout, your body will memorize it or in a term understand it will know it so that by the next time you do it around your body will in a way technically you know from my understanding will not exert as much effort as it did before because you already know how to perform said exercise say a lunch you know like proper form of a lunch where you go down you do a lunch all right maybe at first time you know your your your, your legs hurt and then, you know, eventually you probably do it the proper form. Your back is straight. Your shoulders are back. You're going down parallel to the ground. You know, all that good stuff. Yeah, it's fun. It's really fun. So, yeah, so like I said before, you know, over time, you work your body. You get strong. You lose the weight, you know. Be actually, uh, I'm not honestly, you know, because everyone has their own type of body type. That apparently that's the case. You know, there are people with high metabolism, with low metabolism that are just, you know, but that is not an excuse to, you know, go to your living room because, you know, it's free. YouTube is free. You just have to watch ads, which I recommend you do. Or, or you want to be a YouTube workout fitness instructor, go for it. Because, you know, giving free content, helping the world get strong, get fit, get to their goals that they want to achieve is it's a really cool thing, you know. That's why I commend Chloe Thing for what she's been doing, and and her workouts are really <laughs> interesting. They're yeah, they're really interesting. They they really work. She really works you hard. Okay, so yeah, that's my take on it, workouts. But the thing with that is that also when you're in this when you're in this fitness mindset, I'm like, I was talking about you know just start off like three times a week, right? At most three times a week. Just show up three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Take the weekend off. Just do those. Like a 30-minute workout, anything is better than nothing, honestly. If you want to show up once a week at first, although I don't really recommend once a week, but you know, it's, but you you came from a background of not doing anything at all because there was no, uh, you know, objective of the thought of actually working out and consistently sticking to a plan for others is probably going to be really daunting and then you just backfire or not do it at all I, I don't want you to do that i want you to actually just show up once a week because you know by hu humans by nature right before you know that's the thing with this generation with this era is <laughs> we don't we don't get our necessary workout or fitness objectives within a day anymore i, I want to quote this from a thing that i understood in the past it was about you know hunter gatherers there you go so there were tribes back then where you know they have to actually wake up early in the morning they have to run bring a spear and then you know kill their game and then that's going to be their meal for the day and then they have to do that daily that was their routine and then there's like these groups that they switch alternate uh between you know who has the responsibility of getting food preparing a meal and we don't do that now we just you know there's online shopping you know you can bring groceries to you you can do food panda or doors doors food delivery you know you can just call i want a pizza too large extra cheese and it's just at, at your doorstep so yeah that's the interesting about humans so we really need to supplement that with intentional workout because we're not going out there killing pigs right <laughs> yeah so yeah exercise you beautiful people because it's going to be good for you it makes you feel good makes you feel strong and the fact of being strong is good so anyway that was nine minutes thank you so much and see ya yeah work out